and we report has revealed that Israel provided safe passage for the Palestinian paramedic sent to rescue a six-year-old girl Hind, but killed them all anyway. Hind Rajab had been fleeing Gaza with her family in January when Israeli forces attacked her family's car. Her older cousin then called the Palestinian Red Crescent for help before gunfire can be heard breaking out. The Red Crescent then dispatched an ambulance to rescue Hind, who remained alone with the car for three hours, trapped in the car among the bodies of her dead relatives. However, the Red Crescent then lost contact with the two paramedics on the ambulance crew. After 12 days, Hind was found dead in the car with her relatives, which was peppered with bullet holes. The Red Crescent ambulance crew was also found killed after Israeli forces bombed the vehicle just meters away from the car Hind was in. Israel's military said in a statement that Israeli soldiers were not present near the vehicle or within firing range. However, an investigation by the Washington Post has revealed that Israeli armored vehicles were actually present in the area and that gunshots were heard in Hind's phone call. The report also found that the ambulance sent to rescue Hind had been traveling along a safe route provided by an Israeli military unit. The head of the unit told the Washington Post that the Red Crescent had coordinated everything with the Israeli military, although it was not aware of the details. However, the Israeli military has denied this, saying that the Red Crescent did not coordinate with the unit and reiterated that the troops were not present near the scene. Since Israel declared war on Hamas on October 7, it has killed more than 34,000 Palestinians in Gaza, mostly women and children. Follow for more updates on the situation in Gaza.